Hello and welcome to this quick video about this thing here. Now I've got quite a few things in recently regarding cars and stuff with things like the MT12 radio control coming out from Radio Master. That's one of those kind of classic ground based radios running HTX also available with Express LRS. Now I've had a number of things in recently as well from GT Power. This just happens to be the latest one. Uh, this is the Bluetooth version RC car and sounds lights system. Now I, to be completely truthful, had one of these in and it actually had a little bit of a problem, uh, but I contacted GT Power and they've replaced it, which is fantastic. And this is one of those kind of cool things. It consists of a little unit that goes inside your car or truck and then you connect up a large speaker and there's also all of the lights in here as well for main and side lights but also things like rear lights and for turning indication as well to put it together isn't too tricky there is the link to the manual in the box the manual isn't there however it does show you how you plug everything together it is pretty super basic the manual but actually if you see here on the bench how it's all gone together it hopefully makes a little bit more sense what you need to do is plug in the steering servo and your ESC into the outputs here on the right hand side and then plug the receiver cables that come as part of the kit in over here so your steering and also your throttle but you can also then plug in two additional ones for things like uh, additional lights and additional horn functionality as well to power this thing, it needs to be powered from two separate places. The first is this tap that can be run off anything from two to four S batteries. This comes with Dean's connectors. So if you use Dean's in your ground based models, that's great. However, if it's XT60 you use like I do here, then you're going to need to get yourself an adapter. And that connector goes between the main battery and the ESC. And that then provides the power for the amplifier to make the noise nice and loud of the car. The other thing then you need is to power the whole thing, is you do need the 5 volts from the ESC. SC that you plug in to the throttle output here on the device. That 5 volts is actually what powers the entire system. Surprised that that's needed, so you actually need to have kind of your battery voltage 2 to 4S, and you also need to have the 5 volts here as well. However, the power of the system is really unlocked by connecting to it via the app. Now you can download this from the App Store, install it onto your phone or device, and then from here you can set up how the system works. And you can change the sounds, there's lots and lots of sounds on here, and you can choose the one that you want, you can change the volume. Uh, it initially wasn't available in the App Store, which is one of the reasons why I was reluctant to kind of talk about this on the channel, because that I don't like installing kind of side-loaded apps in things like Android, but GT Power were great, they went away and actually got the application certified, so it's on the App Store now, so you can just download it. And you can actually download it and play with it, even if you haven't got the device to hear all the different engine sounds. Once you've got it all connected, very easy, you just power the system up, it kind of detects it, you connect to it, and then you can just choose which engine sound that you want. And by pu pulling the trigger on the radio control and starting the throttle, it will do the startup engine sound and then the idle, and then it will change the, the note of the engine as you pull the trigger. Similarly, as you move left and right to turn, then the indicators will sound and the indicator LEDs will flash as well. This is quite a cute little system if you want to add that kind of extra realism to the model that you've got and you have enough space to get all this additional electronics inside. It's a little bit bigger than I would have liked and I'm also surprised that you need two different voltages to run it but I suppose if you understand how that works, it took me a moment to figure that out myself with the manual that comes with this, then it's actually not too tricky. I do like the fact that the app is finally in the App Store and that means it's easy to download but I would have liked more control over how the light worked and be able to select between main and side beam how the braking lights work and whether or not I can turn off things like the indicators so when I'm racing with a car they're not active or then when I kind of have it in pit mode that I can turn them on and off hopefully maybe that's going to be included in a future firmware release. But I thought I'd just draw your attention to this. This is quite a cute unit if you do want to add lights and sounds to your radio controlled car or truck. However, I don't have something that I want to install this in right now. So I'm going to do a giveaway. If you would like to get this 
actual unit I have in my hands here and have a go yourself, then standard stuff. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll pull the names out of the hat in a couple of weeks. Good luck to everybody, and I'll put a link down below for those of you that want to come find out a little bit more about this GT Power Lights and Sound Kit. Thank you for watching the video. If you watch my videos and find them useful, then please take a moment to hit the like and subscribe button. It helps the channel a lot. If you really like what I'm doing here, you can become a Patreon and support the time I spend helping others and get access to lots of exclusive benefits. Link is in the video description. Remember that all the videos on the channel are organized into playlists, so you can easily use those playlists to find all the videos on a subject that you are interested in. Add Painless360 to your searches on Google and YouTube, and it'll help you find my content for any particular topic. Thanks again for watching, and as always, happy flying.